All right, I just want to take a moment and talk to you about the REACH temperature card that you find in your book uh, and you find throughout the book. We're going to come back to this every week uh, as we go through the REACH study. Uh, and I just wanted to say a couple of words about what this card is and how it works. This card is designed for you to take your temperature, your what we call your REACH temperature, your outreach temperature. It's about your heart uh, towards others, towards those who are far away from Christ. But I want you to note this. This is not about how you feel as much as it is about what you're doing, right? And so this is not like th this week I really am passionate for the lost. And so you would, you note it's on a scale of one to 10. One is like you're frozen. You have no heart for the lost. 10 is you're on fire and can't be any more aggressive in terms of your love for the lost. It's not about how you feel. It's about whether your feelings translate into action. And so you note on every temperature card, it says a couple of different words and they're on that continuum from one to 10. On the left side, it, words like apathy, uh, where it described as being unaware, disobedient, and even hostile towards the idea of sharing your faith with others, right? Those are are, are sort of just practices. Those, those are the way that you live your life. Growing passion, right? You're, you're, that's like three and four, where you're starting to become more aware of, uh, of the lost and God's heart for the lost. You're starting to pray and push into the practice of praying for others and building relationship with others. And then you just start to keep moving to the right as, as you begin to actually engage, invite people over for a meal and, and do things with them that you begin to share your faith with them. Suddenly that temperature goes higher and higher and higher. The idea with a reach temperature card is weekly, we're going to be asking each other what our temperature is. And you're gonna to have to do the difficult work, this is not always easy, of saying, yeah, you know what? I'm a number three. I didn't, I didn't even pray this week for anybody on my list. Or for some of you, you're gonna celebrate. You're gonna say, I'm a number six. I had a conversation with my neighbor and you're gonna to celebrate together. And the goal is week after week, we're adding maybe even just one degree, one, one step to the right. And before you know it, you'll, you'll find that you're, you're living a life where you're reaching out for others.